Hello, ladies and gentlemen, once again, welcome back. So today we are speaking about natural hair. I joined a natural hair journey uh, four months back. That was in December 2021. However, I've been keeping my hair as relaxed hair. Or, um, so uh, it was not until I got pregnant with my last uh, let me say my last one, my youngest child, my youngest son. So I got issues uh, with uh, saints. I could not manage to go to the saloon to have my hair relaxed, to have my hair worked on. The smell of the different relaxing oils was just bad on me, guys. I hope you understand, ladies. Uh, they would really take me seriously, but I did not like the oils at all. So it was at that time that I decided to trim my hair. I shortened my hair and I was not uh, keeping it anymore, but I had some little hair on the head. So in December 2021, I made up my mind to keep my hair naturally no heat on my head no blood drying no hot combing so i decided to go purely natural and i started to uh, to moisturize my hair and it was uh by then that this product i used to use it when uh, I, I failed to go to the saloon i made this oil and i was using it on my hair and I realized it would soften my hair, so I took a step ahead to make it and start using it on my pure natural hair. No more heat, no more nothing, guys. Nothing at all. Only the oil and uh, the water and also a grease to seal in my hair. So it was by then that I started using the three products on my head. This is just water. I reused this bottle. This bottle had some cosmetic inside. So I put in water in this bottle and it's down that I used to spray on my head. This bottle sprays nicely. You can see how it sprays water. It does not just wet your head, but you can make the hair just a little bit damp without dripping any water. So, and then this oil, this is carrot oil. It's carrot hair growth oil. And this brand, it's called uh, Soft Hair Naturals. This brand is meant to keep your hair moisturized, soft, and facilitate growth of your hair. This product you see here, I made it with a mixture of ingredients infused together. Uh, the major ingredient in this oil is the carrots, and then it has ginger, it has a eucalyptus oil, and it also has tea tree oil. Those amazing oils are very good for your scalp and healthy hair. This oil, apart from softening your hair, making it soft, it also aids growth and it also treats your scalp. Are you suffering from dandruff? Get yourself this oil. This oil goes as cheap as only 20k this size but i also have smaller bottles i have a small bottle the smallest at 3500 shillings it's a bottle of 30 mil and this and i have another one of 100 mil at 15000 and this one goes for 20000 it's 250 mil bottle so guys this oil will do you amazing you will thank me later after using it. So after using that oil, I always use the blue magic grease to seal in my moisture into the hair. Praise the Lord, ladies in the house. So today, even as we are taking care of our hair, we are going to read a scripture 
uh, in math, a scripture in First Peter, First Peter chapter three and from verse three up to five. Let's get there. The book of First Peter. So, guys, we want to see what does the Bible talk about here. There is nothing that is being done in the world that the Bible does not have a thing to say about. So I just want to tell you the women in the channel that God had your hair in plan. He knew that you will need that hair. And therefore, he has your hair too in plan. He has what he wants you to do uh, about your hair. First of all, in First Corinthians chapter chapter 11 and verses 15, the Bible talks of the hair being a, a woman's pride and joy, and it is a covering given unto her by God himself, of course. So women, it's not a mistake if you kept your hair, but keep it natural and also uh, let it not take up the position of God in your life. And it should not take up the position of your husband. Hallelujah. Women in the house. Praise the Lord. So, First Peter chapter 3, uh, verse 3. It says, Don't be concerned about the outward beauty of fancy hairstyles, expensive jewelry, or beautiful clothes. You should clothe yourself instead with the beauty that comes from within, the unfading beauty of a gentle and quiet spirit, which is so precious to God. This is how the holy women of old made themselves beautiful. They trusted God and accepted the authority of their husbands. Praise the Lord, ladies in the house. Let me sit well. The Bible speaks about the inward beauty, the inward beauty of a gentle and quiet spirit. Women, we should not always be the ones, the first one to talk. Bah, 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 bah. Be quiet in your spirit and be gentle. Praise the Lord. A quiet and gentle spirit listens to the concerns of others. It ministers to others and also it listens to the Holy Spirit. Praise the Lord, women. So the Bible tells us not only be concerned about our out outward beauty, but we should also be concerned about our inward beauty. That is the beauty of a gentle spirit and a quiet spirit. That is what God is uh, wanting from the women. Praise the Lord. And we should also remember to be under the authority of our husbands. Hallelujah. Oh, God. I just like God. God is so amazing. You know, the Bible speaks of... Uh, the Jesus Christ, uh, God being the head of Jesus Christ, and man, Jesus Christ being the head of man, and uh, uh, the man being the head of a woman. So women, we glorify the men. Men glorify Christ. Christ glorifies God. Hallelujah. This is so amazing and unique. Praise the Lord. So Let's get to our routine of maintaining hair. Praise the Lord. Women, as I told you, I use three products on my hair. And the first product is water. Praise the Lord. When I put water on my head, on my hair, I just spray a little bit of water on my hair. It is a quick, I don't need to take 10 minutes on my head. So after spraying the water, I go in with my growth oil. This oil, I apply it on my scalp. I apply it on my scalp. And also on top of my hair and I massage in thoroughly. I massage it 
onto my scalp and then after that I seal in the moisture with my blue magic grease. Praise the Lord, women. I don't take thousands of hours on my hair. So since my hair is already on a protective hairstyle, this is how I maintain my hair. I don't need to do much. So I keep my hair like this. This twists have stayed for one week now. And I will be taking them down after two weeks. I have a hair wash routine. As a natural, it is very important to have uh, a hair wash routine that you maintain throughout. That is how we can manage to keep our hair moisturized and soft. I wash my hair after every two weeks because I always keep it in a protective hairstyle. I cannot keep my hair for a full month when it's not washed. For me, no, 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 I cannot do that. Um, other people wash their hair after every one week, they wash. When you wash your hair, you deep condition it, and then you apply your leave-in, and then you can also now go ahead and seal in the moisture, and then you can wear it in any protective hairstyle that you want. You can twist it, you can braid it out, or you can uh, plate cornrows, and then you wear your wig depending on your preference. Uh, a must know for any natural, natural hair needs to be moisturized. And the greatest moisturizer for natural hair is water. When you put water on your head, make sure you add in some oil and then you also seal in the moisture. With either butter, like sheer butter, you can use grease to seal in the moisture and then you braid out your hair. Never leave your hair exposed on the sun for a long time. It will be dry thorough. Now, having uh, spoken all that, I want to go through a must-have and a must-do for every natural hair person. Uh, on my list, I have a few things. One, a shower cap. If you're a natural, you must have a shower cap. If you're going to shower, wear your shower cap. Then you go and shower like this. Then you go and take your shower. A shower cap is not meant for sleeping. Never wear your shower cap to sleep on it on your bed. It is not uh, proper. A shower cap is meant to keep away water from your hair when you're going to bathe. Praise the Lord, ladies. So, the next thing, if you're going to sleep, wear your satin bonnet. This is a satin bonnet. It is made out of a satin material. It helps to keep moisture in your hair. The moisture in your hair does not get absorbed into it. So when you're going to sleep, you wear your satin bonnet like this. So you wear this, then you go and take your nap. You go and sleep. So ladies, those are a must have. We shall be going on and on and on with our talk. But don't forget to order for your carrot oil, courtesy of Mercy Cares. This brand is called uh, Soft Hair Naturals. And this oil is amazing. It will promote your hair growth and it will also keep your hair soft. Ladies, if you have children and you're keeping your daughter's hair, She's a natural. Please get yourself this oil for that baby. You will really love it. You will thank me later. This oil will make your child's hair soft and manageable. This oil, I made it specifically for natural hair ladies. If you have relaxed hair, I cannot guarantee you to use this oil. But if you're a natural like me, you can use this 
oil or if you're transitioning from relaxed hair to natural hair you can use this oil and very soon we shall be having shea butter added to this this um this amazing brand we shall have shea butter god willing so i've spoken a lot i hope you've got something so remember to subscribe to this mercy cares family in this channel i speak about the word of god i teach about uh, general life we speak issues concerning hair issues concerning health so this channel is a place for everybody a woman's beauty is in the hair don't forget about that ladies let's take care of our hair and let's take care of our baby's hair and please remember to come back again next time i'll be back with another interesting video don't miss out be a part of this lovely family and subscribe subscribe comment comment below don't forget to comment and like this video all naturals if you have guys i never mentioned this if you have gray hair like me on your head it is normal to have gray hair on the head praise the lord it should not bother you you don't need to dye your hair every week but however if you're not comfortable with it if you're not confident with it please you can apply color on your hair you can apply black henna whatever what you want is best known to you but for me i'm just embracing my gray hair guys i cannot end this video i have a lot to talk but let me just say goodbye from here i'll miss you till we meet again i love you all